Hi, Caitlin. Look at how cute you are. Good morning. So, today is the Caitlin's first day. I'm interested to see how this will go. So, we are off on our way to the dentist again to get checkups, even though we were there last week. Caitlin's gonna come back. They don't start actually doing checkups on kids till they're like three, but she's gonna come back and sit with us and they say the hygienist might let her like hold some of the tools just to kind of help get her acclimated and accustomed to what happens at the dentist office. I don't know. They go really well or really poorly. But Caitlin has been dealing with doctors and weird things since she was a little baby. So I'll bet she'll be a champ. Hi! Are you saying hi? That is your kitty cat. Yes. Show the camera your kitty cat. Turn her around. Can I see her face? Look at her. Yes. So, Caitlin. Squirrel! Oh yeah, he's up there. Um, Caitlin has went almost a whole week now without her passy, so I think we have successfully broken the passy. It was a matter of simply just putting it out of sight. She asked for it like once after that and hasn't even mentioned it since. I think she mentioned it another night again. Oh. But I reminded her that I told her she would get a prize if she went without it. Uh -huh. It was a big girl. She just let it go. Okay. So yeah, so yesterday after church we went and got her, her prize. So she got a kitty cat and then one of those little pop 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 mowers. She'll, she'll show you later. She was so excited on the drive from church to go <laughs> get her prize the whole time. Prize? Prize? Two and a half and she knows what that is. We created a monster. Just kidding. Yeah, you're holding your prize. Little girls need special things. So, yeah, that was a lot of fun. And it's a lot of fun not worrying about that stupid passy. I'm so glad it's gone. But yeah, she goes to sleep, takes naps, just fine. So, now, maybe we'll be able to get her to a transition to the big girl bed. That's the next transition. So. She was excited when she went in there and remembered that we set her up for her. Yeah. She came to the door. Then. <laughs> so, this does come with a story a little bit, did not So, before you have a kid, you have all these plans of how it's going to go. And you think you know how it's going to go? Because, like, we were like... She's not sleeping in our bed, no co-sleeping, she's going to breastfeed for a year and a half, she's going to do this, this, and this, and uh, none of that <laughs> happened. Cause the, so the first, Caitlin, we didn't get her CF diagnosis until she was 30 days old. So for that first month, her tummy was just upset and she, like, she wasn't gaining weight. So she was basically just starving because CFers, that's why she takes enzymes because their bodies can't absorb the fats. So everything, like formula and breast milk that she was getting, was just going right through her. So she was just starving. So we'd be on the bed, we'd be sleeping on the couch, we didn't sleep at all. And so, for, and for that first month. And then once we got the diagnosis, and kind of got things under control, and tried to start transitioning to the crib from our bed, by that point we were all just in, I don't know. We were co-sleeping because that was just what we did to survive that really rough start. And so she's just been in our bed ever since and she's not a cute little newborn anymore. Now she's a giant. And look at her. I'll show you. This is your blankie. See, lay down. <laughs> look at her now. Yeah, you can <laughs> sleep here. So big. Such a big girl. That doesn't go on here anymore. That way you can climb in and out. Okay? Do you like this? What's it pinkies? She got up and sat down. And just said, this is cool. Huh? Okay. Look at you, Caitlin. This is cool too because another thing about CF is right so 
if we were living in like the 50s or 60s, Caitlin, children were considered lucky to make it to kindergarten. Oftentimes so, back in the day, CF children die within the first year of life because it's just, they don't gain weight. I mean, their body just doesn't work properly. But Caitlin is big. She's two and a half and she's gonna grow to be 200 years old and sleeping in her own bed. Huh. I'm gonna take it. I don't know. But we don't need it anymore. So. Well, uh, maybe for now we'll just store it. Yeah. Oh yeah, and here's Caitlin's blankie that her Aunt Nancy made for her. Bless her heart. I guess to be her great aunt, actually. She passed away recently. You can have that. Oh, look at that. So much patience. Cross stitch. Yeah, that's, that thing is awesome. Okay. So cool. Do you like this? It's a kitty cat. That is a kitty cat. What's this? Bunny. Bunny? What's this? Perfect. What is it? Perfect. Yes. Okay. What's Ow. this, Caitlin? You gotta be careful. Caitlin. There. There. Yeah. Okay, scoot down. What? You want the light off? Good night. Daddy. It's so cool. <laughs> I'm right here. You don't have to stay. This is just to... We're just getting ready. Yeah, you don't have okay. to go out. You're, we're not in a hurry. Yeah, it's okay. We're just trying to move towards getting you in your own bed. Yes, so today will be a lot of fun. So, we're starting off at the dentist office, and then we've got a whole bunch of other stuff planned on that we're... That we've got planned today. So, and actually it'll be something new for Caitlin and I later, because we've never been to this, this place that Brian is taking us later on. So, that's exciting. And, oh, also... We can leave the house. No jackets. No jackets. Oh, life is so good. I hope your Monday's awesome. Keep hopping. No? Uh-uh. Don't put your fingers in your mouth after you touch the water, honey. Puddles. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Is that your kitty? Bye. <laughs> Say bye-bye, doggy. Hey, man. Well, we're all done with our checkups for today. So, Caitlin, she was entertained for about 10 minutes, five minutes before she wanted to leave the room and go outside. So, mom took a turn with her outside walking around, and then when I went in, Brian hung out. We actually drove home real quick. Why? To get my coffee and to get her some juice. Mm. And to kill some time. Oh. to drop off the movie that they loaned us. It was a while ago. But we finally watched it last night and we're dropping it back off because it's Brenda's favorite. It was Dear Kennedy. Well, love Kennedy. Way good. Where are we? Can you say chicken? No. Not chicken? Oh. Chick-fil-A. Ryan's spoiling us today, apparently. Hi, Caitlin. We're gonna have a picnic in the living room. We gotta have our lunch, huh? Before we can get on with the day. I know yeah. you wanna go on a hike. We're trying to make lunch fun so that she, we can eat and then do other stuff, but I think we're gonna have to stop like revealing our plans to Caitlin. 
depends how we actually are like going to do whatever it is. Yeah, because this is. But I finally get to wear my new hiking boots. Brian took me out last week after the dentist to go get me some hiking boots, and I found these. There you go. You can wear this shirt. It's okay. So. We just need to have pants on. I'm so excited, babe. Or would to wear you my like, boots. Do you want a long sleeve shirt? Okay. Okay. I'm glad you like them. Where are we going? Are we going on a hike? Yeah, yeah say hike. hike. Yes. Pretty dog, Caitlin. Oh, she's gorgeous. <laughs> Wanna get in the pack? Yeah, I'm getting get in the pack with Dad. Look, see it? You can ride in the pack. Yeah. I just want to pull your pants up. Good job. What? No. Caitlin, what do you think of that? <gasps> Ready for your ride? I think I might have been slightly skinnier the last time I wore this. <laughs> All right, I guess we're ready. Okay. Is this fun, Caitlin? What do you think? It's like single. Right. Gotta listen for people on bikes coming downhill. <laughs> They're moving faster. Maybe we'll run into Mason and Britain. <laughs> this is probably too amateur of a trail for them. Yeah. No a couple of uh, Brian's cousins are into the whole mountain bike racing circuit. So they're up here in these mountains all the time. Pretty cool.
Caitlin? Are you having a good time? Yeah, she just wants to go, huh? Do you want to keep going a little bit? You want to go up? Go up up a little down, more? Caitlin. Down? Down. Let's go up just a little bit so that we're like right above the river. You do want it this time? Well, so far she loves it. Just like she did last year. She oh. did not want to get in though. So much pretty things to see, huh? I did not notice that the other day. How did I not see it? That's a raccoon. Uh, I think so. No, it's not. Sorry, a dumpster cat. <laughs> it was a dumpster cat. What it looks like. Yeah. It's a raccoon. Yeah, there's a raccoon. <laughs> Brian calls raccoons dumpster cats. And every single time it makes me crack up, even though he says it, I think, at least once a day. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're five year olds. You see that rock? Look, look down here. Caitlin, someone left you a message. Oh. Oh, why? <laughs> so pretty. Yeah, this has been a lot of fun. Ooh. She's looking at the trees and everything. See it when she went flying past us. <laughs> well, that was a lot of fun. Caitlin, did you have a blast? Was that so much fun? <laughs> yeah, nice and tired now, huh? And now we have to go home and rest for a while. Oh, yeah. First hike of the year for uh, together. That was so fun. It's good stuff. Yes. I love that Caitlin loves to be outside, but children follow after their parents, and Brian and I love to be outside. We don't even, we don't like TV. We don't we like to go. TV is just kind of a winter, filler. yeah, kill time type thing. Yeah, but now I mean we don't need TV anymore. There's so much to just come out and look at. This is way more interesting <laughs> than TV. Yeah, yeah, God will entertain you. <laughs> Caitlin, Dad's gonna get you. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. Well, these boots are awesome. They're so comfortable and they're light and they have good traction and they're comfortable. Save rolls. 
Oh. Yes. Well, we haven't done anything, well, with the, this since we came home. And I have to indulge and film the dinner I made because I only get to do that like once a week. <laughs> so, this is, it's chicken, pesto, bacon, tomato, pasta. Bacon. So, yeah, there's bacon in it. Your favorite, huh? You're excited. Yeah, we're trying to find ways to add more uh, vegetables to our meals. And meals like this where they just kind of hide with a bunch of other flavors, that's good. No. We can handle that, right? No. Did you already get butter in here? No, I forgot. You ready? Yeah. Ready. Okay. Ready to see something cute? Hi, Mama. Is it Mama? Yes. Are you being a helper? Yeah. Yeah? Are you helping Dada? Show me how you get put clothes in the dryer. It's your jacket. That is your jacket. Uh-huh. Is it pants? Those are your pants. Can you put them in the dryer? <laughs> yes. Good job. You're smart. Can you get these ones? Not yet. You guys are so cute. You get this one in there? What a great helper. Mama? That is Mama's shirt, yeah? Here you go. Thank you. Well, thank you. <laughs> Can you get that one? Oh, I don't think I can get that one in. Can you? Is it blue? Is it green? Yes. And the other towel is green, huh? You're so smart. Is it Saki? That is a Saki. Is it Katie? That yeah, is Katie. Is it Oh, come show me your kitty. Oh, she is so pretty, Caitlin. I can't remember. I can't remember if we've mentioned it today or not. But Caitlin got a special prize for breaking her passy. So she's got her little kitty. And then Caitlin, come here. Let's get your popper. <laughs> That's exactly how she walked out of the store. Pushing her popper and holding her kitty. And thankfully most of the people that we walked by, they just got a kick out of it and thought it was cute, so. But I mean, have you seen Caitlin? She's cute. Even when she's a monster. You're not a monster. I'm just teasing. Hi, Caitlin. Is it a cat? That is a kitty cat. Hey, show me how you can be a big girl. Yep. Keep going. Almost there. Perfect. Good job, honey. Okay, cat. Okay, cat. Is that your horsey? He was your pack mule today. Yeah, now his back's killing it. Well, <laughs> that's how we get better. Yep. Pain. Yes, today has been non stop for the most part. But that's a good thing. Those jammies. gonna be able to get back up she doesn't even care about the camera anymore she's done can you say night night <laughs> night night say night night bye bye see you soon <laughs> she's so cute can't get better than that. nope <laughs> okay good night <laughs>